linebackers and the, and the other defensive backs, you know, because I think without them doing their job as far as putting pressure on the quarterback, um, getting hits on receivers and slowing them down for me, you know, basically I just read the quarterback, you know, and wherever he's looking, I kind of lean towards that receiver and um, try to get a good break on the ball. You know, we all know each other pretty well and, um, and, and we all trust each other. You know, we, we have the utmost confidence in every person at his individual position. And um, I think that, you know, we just have the guys in the, in, in the defense this year who, who re who's really out to, you know, to go out and, and just be as intense as they can every, every play of the game. You know, you, we want to get to the ball. We want to swarm. You know, we want to have some, you know, some bruising hits, you know, make people remember us. And um, we have the type of guys with that attitude and that temperament, you know, to want to get that done every Saturday. Throw on third, batted in the air, and intercepted! Rip it back to Gore. Go on deep down the middle, and the pass is intercepted by Marcus Ball. Hey, and that's the second interception for Ball. That's what the Bears needed. The Bears needed a big play. Marcus Ball with the pick. To the middle, picked off, intercepted by Marcus Paul. Hello, my name is Marcus Paul, and I'm the strength and conditioning coordinator for the Dallas Cowboys. Next, we're going to do Superman. Do our single leg glute play.
hour, the Cowboys announced that strength and conditioning coach Marcus Paul has passed away at a local hospital after a medical emergency. Jerry Jones called Marcus Paul a loved and valued member of the Cowboys family, a pleasant and calming influence in our strength room and throughout the star. Our hearts are broken for his family and all of the individuals whose lives he touched and made better. And Mike McCarthy described Paul as a leader who earned the players' respect and attention because he cared so much and was a naturally gifted communicator. It was a privilege to work with him as a coach and laugh with him as a friend. Marcus did everything the right way.